So we know UIM provisioning center simplifies the administrative and operational tasks within a V block, but what about the ongoing health? How do we ensure that the operational integrity and, and, and actual health of all the components is maintained? So again, we go into UIM provisioning center and we look at our, our services that we have defined there, but we can actually from there select to go into operation center. Operation center is that again a single pane of glass that gives you a consolidated view of all the alerts from within the, the, the different components within the V block. What you what you have is the ability to not only look at the alerts that come from each of those physical and, and logical components, but have those actually presented in a way that they're also aware of the service uh, layouts within your within your V block. So it actually direct, directly translates to the to the um, services defined within within UIM provisioning center. From there, you can see that we can we can go into these alerts, and from there gets a a detailed information around around the you know the actual event that's been um, been recorded, the uh, the reoccurrence of those, as well as that you can see through through the hyperlinks, we can actually drill into those components that have raised those alerts and see actually the impacted objects. That, are, that that could be actually um, disrupted by situations that have raised that alert. So in this example, we can see that we've actually gone in, had a look at a at, at the blade, and we can see actually the virtual machines and the virtual apps that are actually associated with that um, with that blade. We can get a good visual uh, representation of, of components and areas that are impacted by an alert, but we can also look at that from a different angle. So we can go into the topology views within the within operation center. Within the topology views, we have the ability through simple uh, textual uh, search engine of, of pulling up different uh, components within there. We, again, you can see we can pull up the services uh, um, and the objects related to that that we actually created within our uh, provisioning center. We, from there, we can actually drill into those objects and again pull up the actual uh, topology diagrams around that that are sensitive from that from that object on. So here, but we get the that, that full sort of V block view around the uh, around that actual component. We can also ha have that ability. You can see that we we get we get extended information around those. See the direct relationship between each context. So you can select objects, and it'll show you the interconnectivity between those. We can also drill further into those objects. So we can within here we can actually we see the actual uh, virtual apps. We can actually through the V app see the actual virtual machines that are actually associated with that and then also the UCS association so let's have a look at that how that actually um, relates back to to virtual center so here you can see within virtual center where we have our, our virtual app defined and then actually that's a direct mapping to what's actually been uh, presented to us within operation center again giving you that giving you that single single point of access that actually gives you the the, the, the overall view on the on the physical layout of your vlock as well as actually the logical virtual layout of of it as well you can drill into each each um, separate object as well and get more granular information you know find out about the you know our associated alerts and and actually dependent objects around that we can walk the tree uh, as well uh, as the object so you can see here that we can we can walk down via the uh, the logical and physical um, side of that we can we can crawl down via the V block we can crawl or come up from the top and go from the virtualization layer go down to the virtual up app and get down into objects down to down to specific VM levels. If we select the V, if we select the VM, we can actually get a, a a again a topology diagram that will show that VM, and then again show those objects that 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 are. Uh, related to that um, directly so talk about the the V app side and then the blade side so talk about the the, the compute and UCS side you can all, again drill down further and keep drilling down start looking at what the storage and the network dependencies etc are giving a very simple way to actually and a single point of access to 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 not only see the ongoing health but also track the code code dependencies and relationships within your V block and from both physical and around the logical and the service layout um, uh, with it domains within that fee block. 
So we've seen that operation center gives that single point of reference for all the alerts coming from each of the individual physical and logical components within the VBOX. It also gives you a very simplistic simplistic visual representation of those components allowing you to drill up and drill down through various objects and uh, components within the v-block so that you know that all the intricacies of codependencies and relationships within there but also allows you to actually integrate into your existing monitoring services through simple syslog forwarding rules that you you, you define you can actually direct those uh, those alerts that have been picked up through operation center to your existing monitoring services allowing you to define rules for around ticketing and actually escalation etc around each of the components within vblock you know it can be targeted to the particular groups whether it be via the services or or via the actual a um, via the actual physical component maybe to your storage or networking teams so operation center allows you to actually ensure the ongoing health the ongoing manageability of your v block is 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 assured and if not that you are actually aware of it